Hey guys, it's Carrie Sims here and I'm back with a, another video and in this video I am going to be doing a full overview of the new stuff pack that just came out, Laundry Day Stuff. This was released on 1pm Eastern Standard Time um, on the 16th. Um, I'm a little late because I um, I'm a little late with this but um, I just wanted to get this overview out. So this is the uh, startup screen when you um, download the pack and open up your game. Um, it says welcome to the Sims 4 laundry day stuff. Um, wash your wardrobe, gather your Sims laundry, load, it, load the washing machine and then toss them in the dryer for a pristine look. Your Sims can also hand wash their clothes in a wash tub then land dry for a spotless outfit that other Sims will surely notice. Build a rustic home. Transform your Sims home with country inspired decor that best suits your Sims lifestyle. Discover new ways to decorate household rooms with wooden tables and wicker furniture. Add decorative items to rooms from colorful rugs and lively succulents. Dress in country style. Outfit your Sims in country themed attire from floral patterns to everyday denim. Styles include free flowing tops and bottoms made from natural cotton fibers. Try hassle free hairstyles that complement your Sims comfortable new looks. Um, yeah, so that's, um, these are all the pictures, um, that it has been going through, um, so let's, um, the first thing I'm going to go through is the cast items, everything that came with cast, then I'm going to go through gameplay, and then, I mean, then I'm going to go through build and buy, and then I'm going to go through gameplay. So we got two female hairstyles, um, this one is a bun and it hangs down a bit, which is a really nice detail, and it, um, comes with a, um, whatever that's called and it did in different colors and this right here is like a um hair clipped back really a mom hair i really like that one and the clips are also different colors too um can't really see that and then we have um five tops this one is really nice um little crop top with um off the shoulder and um this one right here um it's kind of like tied at the side and really nice detail when it's like pulling at the shirt a bit that's really nice um and this right here is a little top. I this is not my favorite one. It looks okay. I might use it, but I'm not. I don't know if I will. Um, and I really like this one. I think I'll use this one a lot. It does kind of look like we have this already in the game, but um, I actually do like it. <laughs> and this one right here, I really really love this one. It's a little crop. We call the halter top. Um, um, the patterns are really nice. I think I will use this one a lot. Um, and then we have this little jeans right here and the belt. Um, I really love the belt. Um, and these are the different colors. I really like it. And then next we have, um, or like I'm kind of showing like with different tops. Um, and I think next we have the shoes. We just said these are boots. Um, really nice. And then these um, wedges or these wedges are sandals. Yeah. And then I will show the full body outfit, or no, not yet. I'm showing the stocking, or no, the full body outfit, and um, looks really nice. I like the floral patterns, but I think my favorite will be the um, plain ones, as you can see right now. I really like the plain ones, but floral, floral patterns look really nice. But the plain ones are more um, are less busy. Um, and then I show the stocking um, or tights. They look really nice with the dress and the boots. And um, there's actually like the stylized outfit just like that. I'm just showing the different colors. So um, I go to the, um, the uh, what's called the unstylized or styled looks, yeah. Um, this is the fresh boho cheek and I show you the dress, um, the tights and the, um, the boots. And it comes with like um, five different colors. Um, yeah. Really like I really like that outfit. I should like all these style looks. Um, look at this one; it looks really nice. Um, and this one too. It's like the little um, top um, shorts. I think those are base game shorts. Um, yeah. And this is um, one of my favorites. It doesn't really look good on my sim though. I prefer the first outfit, but um, it looks really nice. Um, and we have one male hair. Um, comes in all these colors. We actually have like a base game here similar to this one but it is like a different style um yeah 
So the um, next we have um, three tops for male. We didn't have we don't have like a lot of um, outfits like in general, but we have three tops. This is like a really like lazy um, top like for lazy Sims, um, and this is like a stained version as I'm trying to show. And um, I think that was a really um, nice. Um, and we have this top. It's like really similar to the next one that I'm going to show, but I really do like both of them. Um, one of my favorites, um, one of my favorites um, of the Cass Adams that we got, yeah. And then we have two pants. I um, I don't like. I'm not like my favorite. It's not my favorite pants, but it, it does look nice. And um, what I really, really love is these um, joggers um, or sweatpants and. Ooh. The patterns, um, I'm not sure who I would put them on, but it's really fun. Um, I think I'll use the plain ones um, more. And then um, for ch children, since we have this dress, it um, looks really nice. And we also have um, a shirt I'm going to show, and that's for both male and female, um, both masculine and feminine um, top. It's it, like it's like unisex, yeah. So right now, I'm going to be showing the furniture that you get. Um, this right here is like these sofas um you can see the different colors they actually match so i'm showing you guys like they do actually match um yeah and then we have like this little cupboard area and this dresser or side table and another like um, sh um dresser or yeah some other tables they're all tables and then that round table is actually like a dining table that i can see like six or more than six like a lot of um chairs this is another cupboard and this is like a bucket with um detergent and then the detergent like separated and in a basket of um uh baskets <laughs> and um yeah so i'm just showing the colors of those stuff and then next we go to the washer and that's the washer because you can see the raindrop on it and then that's the dryer um and right here you can see that they can be stacked you can actually drag them down um yeah i was i'm in trouble so i had to like go move objects off because <laughs> it was on and um i was trying to show that you can drag them off but you can't put the washer on top of the dryer which i don't know why their reasoning is because of that but mm, yeah so next i'm going to be showing the baskets you actually get three types which is um wicker fabric and then plastic yeah and then i'm trying to wash up the clothesline um we these flowers that are attached together and it's still a tree like elevated and um you know a lot of like plants and then right here is the separated iron board but you can't actually iron um because they only had like a set amount of gameplay objects that they could put in um that is a spice rack um another shelf another shelf um that's separated and broom wreath and um the um window seat area <laughs> and um these two doors and uh, the hanging lights well i didn't show that well but yeah so these are the rugs um three rugs together and then the, they're separated so um you can see that they're actually the same thing but um because people asked for them separate separated they did um separate them so right now is the stylized room i'm showing um off this room right here um if you can see that there is three um colors and i'm showing that off and then the next room is this outdoor area. Show that one off too. And this um, washer, or yeah, this other this washroom. And right here is another washroom. Yeah. So um, that's actually all the built and buy objects. Um, yeah, pretty um, good amount for a stuff pack. Okay guys, so I'm going to show you guys um, the gameplay in this pack. Um, so first, the um, when you change your sims outfit, so let's have um, him right here come here, go here. Um, okay, so if he changes his outfit, um, hold on. to um let's see okay i'll just into whatever you're gonna watch here and you see the laundry hamper filled up that's what happens um and her right here she is a lazy sim 
um, so when she changes her, her outfit, it's going to be um, left on the floor. So let's have her... Um, oops. Um, let's have her change her outfit into um, whichever... So she changed her outfit and um, it is on the floor right here. As you can see, um, so Lazy Slims, they leave their, um, their laundry, their um, pile of clothes on the floor. And regular Sims with, um, so Lazy and Slobs, they leave their, um, their clothes on the floor. As you can see, I dropped it into um, the, um, <laughs> the hamper. Um, so... That's all um, I need. So, um, she oh she changed her outfit again and she left it on the floor. So you can drag it. I'll just grab drag it, but I think um, they can pick it up. Maybe like a neat sim will pick it up. Um, let's have her pick it up then. She can, um, as you can see, she can search pockets, um, and she can also take to hamper. So let's have her search her pockets first, and then. Um, take it to the hamper so this is the cute little anim animation here um, she got 14 simoleons right here and um, she can take it to the hamper and um, kids can do laundry by the way so I'm gonna have her do this pile of laundry when she's um, when she takes it to the hamper and then that will um, Um, pick up clothing piles, do laundry, and you can add to washing machine. Yeah. Um, hold on, but I think they have a bucket down here somewhere. Um, let's see. Um, yeah, they have this, so... Oh, she why did she take it all the way down here there okay but as you can see kids gain responsibility from doing that they also gain responsibility from um, doing the um, doing the washing so she's can, gonna add it to washing machine and um, you can stack the washers and dryers as I showed when I'm in the build and buy um, so she gained responsibility but I just put them on the same level so that she can dry and wash um, so she added it to the um, to the washing machine, but she, it doesn't automatically start because then you can add more stuff. So if I go up, um, or yeah, if I go up, I can have her um, add this to the um, add it to the washing machine, and that will she will come up and take it um, to the washing machine. She can't go up, so uh, I had to rotate it because she wasn't able to um, go in, add it um, to the washing machine, so that she can do that. And um, so we don't have the option to add it to the um, bucket or the, the wash bucket or whatever it's called. Um, I think that's because there's no, oh, there's water in there. Um... I don't know. Maybe it's something else. Um, okay. I think if you click on it, but it's not. Um, it's not. I don't think I can click on it actually. Oh, children can't do this. They can't do the wash bucket. So I think that's why she can't um, do it. Um, if we go to this, he can do it. I don't know why he has add laundry. Probably um, because um, there is no laundry in the hamper because she got it. So she is taking this down to the washer um, 
to the um, washing machine and then she's gonna start it and do the laundry while her parents are sleeping uh, because she's a responsible child and um, I'm also gonna show you guys the things that they can add they have to have flowers plants or um, food in the inventory and you have like two different um, types of additives that you can have um, you can add food and you can add um, flowers or flowers yeah so so you can see the cat is on the um, dryer um, so yeah cats can jump on dryers um, yeah so um, she's just gonna go to bed and I'm gonna show you guys that when she does um, go to bed um, and she changes into her sleepwear she um, it does get added to the laundry um, when she goes into bed you could guys watch watch the um, laundry hamper and you'll see um, Oh, did she decide not to go to bed anymore? Um, okay, so as you can see right here, the laundry gets added um, into the hamper. So she's going to come here and wash the laundry. Um, as you can see, it is washing and if it, when it goes in the dry cycle, um the when your sims watch watch it they actually get dizzy so let's have her watch the laundry and um, she's not gonna get dizzy yet because it has to um go in the um dry cycle or so like spinning really fast um and then what i what i noticed is that um your sims actually gain um fun from watching the laundry i think it's like neat sims gain fun like maybe other sims don't so as you can see the washer is done um she didn't get dizzy um so let's unload and add to dryer maybe um if we ever watch the dryer that would get her dizzy <laughs> um so let's have her um dry laundry and Oh, and we need to clean um clean the lint tray. If you don't clean the lint tray, actually you can have a fire. Um and you also have some upgrade um oh she can't watch the laundry. So maybe she's gonna get dizzy from this. Um yeah. So let's see if she's gaining fun from that. Uh she yeah, she's gaining fun. That's really cool. Um, so you can upgrade. Um, these are the three upgrades. I think this makes the laundry quiet, the washer quiet, quieter. This you can add um, additive like flowers. Um, this is I think pre-soak. It makes your makes it cleaner. So you your your sims have like a like a better moodlet, but it does take longer. Speed cycle makes it um, take quicker. And tungsten drum. I think it's like um i don't remember <laughs> what that is um and okay so peanut is hungry that's her dog <laughs> um yeah so these this is like a laundry room that i built um yeah so she's just she's washing it and i'm trying to see if she does um get dizzy from it um let's hope she does um, she can actually come out here. She can actually um, generate some laundry, and I'll show you guys how um, many ways you can generate laundry. Um, let's see. From him, we can um, click on him. We can actually have him. Um, So your sims can actually um, generate laundry by um, going in the pool. So we can watch the laundry bucket right here and um, see the clothes get added. Um, and they also can do it when they um, when they go and use the um, gym equipment. So I'll have her um, unload this unload and put the laundry away but if we set it the laundry down you can see that we can actually look at um 
the properties or not properties um we can look at um the cleanliness or dryness of the laundry so right now it is um do we hover over it so if we hover over the clothing we can see that it's clean and it's dry and warm so when your sims do change if we have her put this away actually um put, no don't eat that it's supposed to stay in your inventory um see if she put it down actually because if she does then okay. so we can have her put the laundry away and then i'm going to change um have her change um her outfit so we can see that she does get a nice moodlet um let's see and the things that she didn't get the dizzy i guess it depends on what kind of sim you have but she didn't get the dizzy um moodlet so if i were change into this um She gets a playful mood it because she's wearing warm clothing. Um, yeah, so lazy Sims and soft Sims they just leave their laundry everywhere and it is annoying. But um, that's the <laughs> that's what it would be like to have um lazy Sims. So if we have her work out right here, you can see that she's gonna change her um laundry, her um outfit. Okay, so if we have her um workout um that is actually going to be a different um she's going to generate a pile of laundry because she's going to change yep so there and um it is definitely on the floor because um that is um so um right now we can do um add laundry additive and we can add flowers or we can add food so for if we're gonna add food, we can add um, the chips, and when we add the chips, um, I'm gonna show you that the clothing is actually gonna turn up dirty. So now she's adding food, um, and <laughs> you see she's laughing evilly because um, that is like a mischievous thing to do. I don't know if it levels up your mischievous skill. Um, I don't know. Huh. Maybe I don't know. Maybe, but as you can see, she <laughs> the water is dirty because she added food. Um, she's gonna. Okay, so she can wash in the wash tub. Those clothes were already clean and dry. And I think it's because um she actually um because she just like washed the clothes and she just changed it so I've, over time the clothes does get dirty so we'll go back to that and see if it does get dirty um let's cheat her knee because i cannot bother with this um okay but she does still feel playful because of um she's wearing some warm clothing and some clean clothing um so yeah so it's a happy ending playful moodlet basically Adding that to the wash top outside. Um, see so you do that. And the water is dirty. So when the water is dirty, the clothes will be dirty. And you'll see that they'll get like a not a good moonlit from that. So this actually does level up her fitness skill, but only a little bit. So they won't get like super buff from washing in the wash tub but it does level up their fitness skill because you know it's hard work look at her go so um yeah that's how the animation looks like it does kind of look like a pig hole but um yeah so i think she's done let's check um no she's not done she just take like a little break or i don't know so um if we look at the quality if we hover over right here you can see that um hold on Um, the water is murky, so you'd have to um, replace the water. Um, and it actually does happen after you wash it, even if you didn't add food. But if you look at the, um, hold on, maybe I can't see it yet. Okay, so this is her hanging up the laundry, and they do it row by row. Um, yeah, that's basically the animation. So if we over over the laundry should be able to see um i don't know why it's not working but usually when you hover over the laundry you can see um which um the state of it 
so the dryness and the cleansiness. So she's gonna replace the water. She, as you see, she just um, kind of like drains it and then adds um, the water again. And then now the water is clean. Um, you can add the laundry additive to the washer, but it's basically the same thing. Um, so we'd have to wait for that to um, to dry, um, basically. So the um, her hygiene is pretty low, but let's get it more low. Um, let's get it more low, and then you're going to see that when she changes her clothes um, it is going to be dirty yeah also taking a shower does change your clothes too but if she changes her clothes it's going to be dirty oh my god the cat is running away <laughs> great video um, okay I just need to see her change her clothes because she leaves it on ground because she's a little lazy sim. Um, but I think she's gonna go. Um, yeah, so she. It's dirty. And then she actually does. Um, I should have made her take the ball bath, but she actually does take the ball bath. You're gonna see that she changes her clothes and creates another pile. And that pile is gonna be dirty. So you can see cleanliness is filthy and it is dry. So we can put it in here. And when we do put it in there, um, the hamper. Oh, does she not create a clothes pile? The laundry hamper has um, these green, green um, stink clouds um, going, uh, like, coming out of it. And um, I think when she finishes her bath, her, um, her, her clothes should be um, wet, or she creates another clothes pile that's wet. Um... I think our pets are gonna get taken away actually um, but nope she didn't never mind so maybe that doesn't okay um, but if we go down and we actually go to the um, where is it okay if we go to the laundry pile we can see that the we can unload and set laundry down and they are not dry they're still dripping wet but she's gonna take them down so I can show you guys what happens when your sims um, put um, down um, wet and dirty laundry so I think she's supposed to put them away or does she set it down so um, as you can see it's pristine but it's soaked and the scent is foul so it actually is clean <laughs> It actually is clean. Oh, I didn't know that. It actually is clean. It's pristine. Um, it's, but it's soaked and it's foul. So it does. It smells bad. So, I think if you're, um, you can't, huh? Maybe you can't set it down to add it to dryer. Um, actually, let's have her hang it back on the clothesline. Um, but and I'll get back when it um dries because she cannot add it but um, basically when um, maybe it's huh but if you put wet clothes in the laundry hamper it does um, get it does have a form of puddle like under the hamper um, and you actually can put clothes in your inventory so you can put this in your inner inventory and you can so your sims can do um, laundry on public lots, so they can actually have laundromats. Um, I'm actually going to be doing a laundromat build after this, so you guys can check that out when I do post it. Um, and so she's going to hang those back on the dryer, um, on the clothesline. Yeah. Um, I think I showed you guys everything, I just need to show her putting it away. Um, oh, toddlers can also play with the splash in the water but I forgot to add a toddler to this household I knew I was missing something huh okay but you guys saw kids do the laundry and they gain responsibility they can't do the clothesline I think it's too high for them let's see yeah they can't um, they're too short to interact with this um, so that's good but they they're still playing um, feeling playful he is Oh, he's sad because the, the cat ran away. I forgot. Um, but she feels playful too. 
um, because of the warm clothing from her being cha from her changing. And um, what was what well, what Simgu Graham was saying um, that the swinging of the laundry when it sways in the wind it's so relaxing and it is it's a nice animation. Um, I really <laughs> do enjoy it. Just watching it um, sway in the wind. Even though there's, there's no actual real wind <laughs> in um, in The Sims Four, but yeah, if seasons does come, then maybe um, strong winds would make like the clothing like blow off the line. That'd be really cool. Yeah, or maybe heavy rain. Like if it rains, then like your clothes will never dry. That'd be cool if your Sims only had um, they only had a clothesline to dry their stuff, so that they they would be able to dry their laundry until the rain stops. That'd be really. Hmm. <laughs> I was just thinking about that. Um, you can add in add flowers and I forgot to put that too. But you can also add like you can add apples, grapes, plantain. <laughs> I don't pronounce it like that. I used to I pronounce it like plantain, but um spinach, mushroom, daisy, you know, a lot of this stuff. So if you put like a daisy in there, um you can see like that animation. She's gonna wash laundry. Um, but she can come and do this and now she's more sad that um, her um, her cat ran away. Um, okay. So for the um, clothes on the clothesline to dry, I think it takes like for some people it takes six hours. I think um, Graham was saying that it will take like twelve, even twelve hours, which is a long, long time. Um, but that is um, that is realistic because um, hanging on the clothesline is really it takes a long time. So, um, as you can see, she's going to add the flowers, and that gives it, like, a, um, <laughs> should it, did it, does it, I don't think she added it yet, um, but it should have, like, a flower, like, animation, um, coming out, and then if you wash it, um, the the um, smell or scent should be better and I think they get like some sort of happy mood lit from it and you sims can smell other sims um, that's, there's that interaction okay so you can see the pristine um, the, not pristine I mean, you see the, like, the flowers and sparkles and really it just shows that the water um, is um, gonna have like a nice scent um, so I'm trying to wait for these to dry I might just have her wash these and see and put them in the dryer no, can you wash or um, are these still wet or still okay? So she can um, they so they did decay over time and now they are um, dirty. So she can add them to the wash tub. So I'm using this wash tub actually does create a lot of puddles outside. So that's why um, Graham did say that you should um, do it outside more because um, it does create a lot of puddles. Um, and you see little peanuts is it peanut yeah peanut is like watching her do the laundry <laughs> that is so cute so um, she can um, unload and move it add it to dryer um, and we can see the like from those um, and then we can see if we can catch like a pet um, we can children replace water no they can't okay um so let's see if the, we can watch like um if we can catch like um one of the pets um watching the okay so let's dry laundry we're not cleaning the laundry because um let's see if we can um if the fire will start and um the uh, what was i gonna say um the, I think the washing machine can break in two ways, um, plumbing and electrical. If your sim tries to fix the electrical issue with a while she's while standing in a puddle, um, that will actually give them like, a chance of dying. Um, yeah. So it's, it's actually um, surprisingly a lot of danger in this pack, which is really always cool. Um, more danger is always um, is always a good thing. Um, so the dryer is done and we can 
unload and put laundry away and then we can have her change her clothes and see um, what does that um, hold on maybe just um, unload and set set laundry down so we can see um, the state that is in and we can make sure that the scent is actually good um, okay so we can see the flowers coming out of it so it is fragrant um, so I think she will actually um, they will actually get a good mood like when they change her clothes so let's have her change her outfit again and I don't know this. Oh, their electricity will be cut off. Okay. Um. So does she get a good mood lit? Um. Hold on. Oh, you can actually put laundry up here. Um. Didn't mean to. Um. Wait. Let's see the state of this. Oh my god. Huh. <sighs> How do I stop it? Okay, this might be a problem, actually. Um, okay, hold on. So let's look at her moodlet. She did get a clean clothing. Vivian's dressed so fresh and so clean. So she does get a good moodlet from free clean, clean, clean clothing. Yeah. And um, hold on. Did I? Oops. Is it is it clean or dirty? it is dirty okay um we can have him come down here and smell her and i think that will be i don't know why he's um okay maybe it's in me or i think it's in me um huh can she argue about anything like oh i think it's in mischief um Well, this is a new animation was like what's that spot so we can try to like see if he will do that and um, see how this how that looks um, let's see what can he do um, oh so he can sniff fresh clothing so yeah I think she get get that mood like when they do have um, a good smelling clothing um, and then we'll see um, when the washer does dry or the the clothesline does dry we can see if um, how does that if how does that look like when they um, so here's the animation <laughs> I kind of missed it but he sniffed he's sniffing her clothing and um, yeah I think he's saying that oh she smells nice and she's like thank you <laughs> um, so let's see where um uh, talking for a bit. So this is actually dry. Let's have her take it down. Um I think you can see the let's put it away because we already saw the um state already. Just need it to dry some more. So he's going to set the laundry down. And um, for so, I think if we make him change his clothing, he will actually smell gross. Let's try. Um. And then we'll just watch here and see the laundry going to the prow. Yep, there he goes. And um, right now he smells... Is, does he get a bad moodlet? Let's see. Dry clothing. From wearing dry clothing. So he doesn't get... Huh. He doesn't seem to have a bad moodlet for some reason. He doesn't seem to be getting any bad moodlets. I'm not sure why. But um, 
yeah so i think they should be able to get it um try to if you do get this back try to go around a bit because i do i'm i am sure that in the live stream he did say that they do get uncomfortable if they're in bad clothes or maybe i'll see to um if she can smell him and see if that helps anything i don't know why it's in friendly though um or maybe oh maybe it will be mean now because he is in bad clothing no a mischief no hmm. maybe it's because um she just put away clean clothing so that's huh okay can she actually s i have no idea what to do i think maybe if like we um change that after some more they should get a bad mood like because they did put a um away like dirty laundry um maybe i should have um looked at the state before i put it up but i was pretty sure it was um uh really bad um smelling like um foul yeah so i um on my general opinion on this pack i think the cast is um okay it's not the best um i was kind of hoping for a little bit more um stuff but um it's pretty decent for a stuff pack um the cast part um i really do like I, my favorite is um i really do like the female or the feminine outfits um feminine tops and the um what do you call it the male um clothing too i really do um like that so um um the build and buy stuff i think i really really like that it has like this rustic kind of um style some some of these stuff too and it's um i really like i have so many ideas to use it it's a lot of um it has like some clutter items that'd be good to um put clutter in your home and um i always love clutter and um the swatches match um they look nice and i really like the build the build back build my buttons and i think a lot of people are <laughs> actually buying it for those too um and the gameplay is actually astonishingly um in detail because it's a stuff pack and i don't expect much from stuff pack i just expect them to just do laundry that's it and blah blah but the way um graham explained it um in the live stream um it was it's just so in depth and they put a lot of thought like they really thought of everything and it's really something that will actually change my gameplay a bit and i'm i'm really um excited to play with it a bit more even though it's just laundry and a lot of people it sounds really boring to put in the game but i just think they did a really good job with this top back so um yeah uh, i so overall i do think it is a good pack um if it's worth the money yes it is worth the money um yeah and most stuff stuff packs i'm kind of stingy with it i'm like mm, i don't think i want to spend my money on that and i kind of wait for it to go on sale which is not often but if when it does i usually that's when i usually do buy a stuff pack or if i really really need it i really really like it then i do buy it so this is like one of the stuff packs that i actually would buy the like, full price so um i really do think it's worth it and um yeah so thank you guys so much for watching if um you are new to my um if you're new to my channel um please like this video comment down below subscribe to my channel for more videos every single day of the week and while you're at it hit that bell button to get notified when i post and i'll see you guys in my next video bye